to film with friends Missing VHS videotape repeating Welcome back family and crew Today we're looking at 1997's Bleeders Rated R, 1 hour and 29 minutes A man travels to an island with his girlfriend in search of his relatives But he finds maybe more than what he wanted to know uh, stars Gillian Faraby, Pascal Grissel, Roy Dupius, Kristen Lehman, uh, a bunch of other people who you don't really recognize. Uh, this is actually the, but Rudger Hauer. This is actually like the third Rudger Hauer video I've done today, including The Hitcher and Blind Fury. So it's just kind of a weird coincidence. Uh, this VHS release is 1998 from Apex Entertainment. Available special blood bag box or flat art, and this is the one with the blood bag. I always wanted this one. I remember seeing this on the shelves at at uh, Best Buy and always wanting to buy it, but I never did because I, I didn't know anything about it. It wasn't a, or a film that I, I'd seen. I just thought it was such a cool idea to have that blood bag on there. And so this one popped up on eBay within a lot of a bunch of other VH, VHS tapes, and so I got it primarily just to get this. And then I think the HBO uh, Canon video, or HBO... EMI video of uh, Hills Have Ice Part 2. Both those were in there. I got like 6 or 7 videos for like 20 bucks, so it was well worth it. Because this is one I always wanted uh, to collect. So it's actually a screener copy. So for screening purposes only, this is one that they sent out to video stores. It's got some special feature stuff at the beginning of it, talking about the release dates, or the, the street dates for all the, for all the content. But I just really just dig it. Uh, this is directed by... Excuse me, Peter Svatek, written by Charles Adair, Dan O'Bannon, and Ronald Shusett. O'Bannon and Shusett, uh, we know from such great films as being the writers of Alien, and they also did the underrated and really great film Dead and Buried. So it's got it's got a great writing crew behind it, and it's got a great VHS to collect. It's just, it's just fun playing with it. I'm actually surprised the stuff in there hasn't like dried out and become crusty after what 24 years. But yeah, Gothic Horror, 92 minutes. This is just one that. It's just, it's so stupid. It's just one I always wanted 24, 25 years ago, and I never bought. And then I'm still, I'm just happy and gleeful that I have it now. So it's a cool one to have in the collection. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Did you guys ever see this on the store shelves back in the 90s? Uh, if so, did you buy it? Did you wish you would have bought it? It's just fun. It's just fun to play with. Uh, as always, like, comment, share, subscribe. Check out the trailer and other content, and I will see you next time.